All right, welcome everybody. Today we're gonna to learn about how to make an actor look at another actor in Unreal Engine 5. So I'm gonna start off by just making a little dummy uh, sentry gun looking thing. I'm gonna to go to the prop section, pull out one of the uh, material sample nodes. This will be our, our uh, sentry gun. You will give it like a steel look. So it's like kind of cool looking and like the, I don't know, like some sort of like cool glowy Hex. Glowy hex thing. Yeah, there you go. There's a sentry gun. All right, cool. So uh, we're going to uh, have this object selected. We're going to click on the little um, flowchart looking thing here to turn it into a blueprint. You said hex texture way too much. Yeah, it's, there, you only got so much in, a, in a, this starter content, you know. So I'm going to call it turret or turret BP. I'm going to save it into my own directory of all my stuff. I'm going to go into the event graph here and I'm going to make it every tick look at the player. So um, the magic node that you're looking for is called um, find look at rotation and it takes your location as the start and it takes the player's location as the, as the uh, target and then it's going to return what's called a rotator so that it looks at it. Okay. So what we're going to do is we are going to get our location, get world location. So we're going to get our location, and that is going to be the start. And then we're going to get the player's location, get player upon zero. It's the first player, and we are going to get their location as well. And that's going to be the end. So we're currently uh, here, and the person we want to look at is there. And so this returns what's called a rotator, which tells us how to rotate uh, from here to there. And so what we can do, just do is set uh, rotation. So we're going to set our rotation to that every uh, frame. Snap the tab up here. And it doesn't move. Why? Well, these error messages will tell you why. Uh, the, the mesh by default is set to not be able to be moved. So what you got to do is you got to go into your blueprint, go to the viewport, Click on it, and right here you will see that you need to set it to movable. Once you do that, compile, save. Once you do that, then this thing will now smoothly rotate towards you. Yay! But notice there's a problem where it's like it's kind of like tilting backwards, <laughs> you know, which <laughs> it's, it's a little, little, eh, yeah, eh, don't really like that. So let's uh, let's add on a little bit more to this. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna set the yaw of the sentry gun. So uh, whenever you talk about rotation, there's pitch, roll, and yaw. Pitch is looking forwards or looking backwards. Roll is like an airplane uh, tilting one way or the other. And yaw is like what you do when a ballerina spins or when you rotate in a chair like this. This is yaw, not yawn. That's what my students do. My students yawn. This is yaw. You yawn too. Do I yaw? That's yes. what I have coffee for. Okay, so, yes, you do. so what I'm going to do is I am going to split the, uh, the pins here, right click, choose split st uh, structure. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get my current, uh, get rotation, uh, I'm gonna get my current world rotation. So I'm gonna get my current rotation, I'm gonna split that one open as well. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just keep my current roll the same, I'm gonna keep my current pitch the same, but I'm gonna bring the yaw over here, okay? And uh, I could feasibly probably do that a little bit more differently, but whatever. So now, uh, then it will just yaw. So yaw, again, is like you're spinning on your chair. Um, it won't tilt forward, it won't tilt backwards, and you now have a sentry gun that will always look at your target. The end. Bye-bye. <laughs>